When I was born, uh, well, actually, they didn't have me diagnosed when I was born. But in June of 60, which was when I was six months old, I, I got a really severe pneumonia. And uh, that's when they took me in and at Kaiser in um, Panorama, not Panorama, uh, Hollywood, Sunset and Edgemont. And uh, the doctors there were saying, you know, he just might have cystic fibrosis. Let's test him for that. And um, this was how old? This was, I was six months old. And I had a really severe pneumonia. So they tested me. And sure enough, the sweat test is what they use, indicated that um, I did have CF. One of the slogans for cystic fibrosis uh, to study or to, one of their slogans is kiss your baby. If your baby has a salty kiss, test them for CF. Because when we do sweat, they don't know why it necessarily works that way, but one of the symptoms <coughs> of the disease is that for some reason we don't reabsorb the salt. When we sweat, we have five times the normal salinity on our skin afterwards. Now, when they first diagnosed me and found that out, it was like a very grim family get yeah. together. And they're like going, do not get attached. He will not live to see his fifth birthday. You know, the funny thing was, I didn't think I really had a disease. Exactly. See, it, what was interesting was that my, my grandfather, my mom's dad, when he kind of he was always kind of a patriarch on my mom's side of the family, so he kind of took things over. I was encouraged to be active. I was encouraged yeah, normal to... Th there was no difference for me than anybody else, any of my schoolmates or anything else. I, you know, the only difference I did finally realize on my own was that I coughed a lot more than maybe. But I could still run, I could still do things, I still, you know, and I was still fairly physically active. The major lung disease didn't really hit me until my 20s. There was a period in 63 where my mom underwent a uh, nervous breakdown from uh, her condition of manic depression, which I believe now the politically correct term is bipolar disorder. <laughs> anyway, uh, so my, my mom's folks ended up taking us on. And then they raised us for the next 10 years for a while. And they were very active people. My love for nature I definitely attribute to my grandpa Ron Booker.